The next question is this, will resistance training help me lose weight? Muscle tissue burns more calories at rest than fat tissue. So the short answer is yes, resistance training will help you lose weight. Resistance training helps burn off fat tissue and gives the muscles underneath a pleasing shape. It enhances and accentuates muscle shape. It is the only real way to sculpt your body's shape. Getting rid of fat reduces overall body size and weight, but shape and aesthetics is done with resistance training. Once the fat that covers the muscular structure underneath is removed through a calorie deficit, the only way to shape the muscles underneath is by resistance training. And incidentally, even though resistance training will help you lose weight, it's important to realize that it does this by making muscles not only stronger, but also bigger. In fact, all exercise increases muscle size to whatever degree you choose according to your goals and training strategy. Now that might come as a surprise. You cannot make a muscle smaller by exercising it. The only way a muscle would get smaller is either through inactivity and atrophy, the classic example being when you break a bone and it stays in a cast for a period of time, or when the body has exhausted all its fat tissue and has to turn to consuming muscle protein as an alternative. Now that is highly undesirable and essentially starvation. A very low level of body fat is in fact unhealthy. Bone structure cannot be changed and nor can actual muscle shape. A muscle has fixed attachment points on the skeleton and short of surgery these can't be altered. So the only thing changing when we change a muscle through exercise is its size. But this alteration in individual muscle size is what gives our body its new shape. It's also important to note that if you have certain anatomical features, for instance long arms or broad shoulders, you cannot change this. For example, swimming did not give the Olympic swimmer Michael Phelps his long arms and broad shoulders. His long arms and broad shoulders are part of what made him a champion swimmer. Another important point is to make that you lose fat tissue and build muscle tissue. You can completely transform the way you look without actually altering the reading on your bathroom scales. Muscle tissue is heavier than fat tissue, so you can build a little muscle and burn more fat and your weight might not change, even though you will look radically different in the mirror or to an observer. You will have noticed there is not a lot of emphasis placed on your weight read by scales in the course. Even the onboarding form that you did at the beginning, the question about weight was in fact to use in the calorie calculator to calculate a calorie requirement rather than as a measurement to check progress. Better ways of assessing progress are the way your clothes fit and the reflection you see in the mirror. I realize not everyone likes or even owns a mirror, in which case clothing fit really is a good way of gauging progress.